It's Lam Duang. I just went to the bathroom at Whole Foods in Annapolis, Maryland, as a Hebrew Muslim. And my nationality is Moorish American, I'm Ron Arrington, your wife um, this lifetime. And as I was bent over on a toilet stool in the bathroom, a visual of this um, pale skinned guy that was sitting um, across, it looked like him, it could be somebody else, um, that was mumbling to himself appear it could have been somebody else and so i'm bent over on the toilet still doing about a little bit and so i'm urinating and all of a sudden um as because i was trying to dismiss this visual and um there are uh, females in the bathroom um someone attacked my genitals as i was bent over on the toilet still urinating in the bathroom so um once again imani gray hyphen bay and i Rhonda errington um hyphen bay we don't know um, know anyone personally here in Annapolis, Maryland, because um, we have affirmed to uphold the Constitution, this natural divine law of freedom. And, um, but we realize masses of people have not. And so they are operating on a foreign jurisdiction. And not only that, so by them operating on a foreign ju jurisdiction, they are vulnerable to be used as spiritual terrorists. And, and that includes mental terrorists and physical terrorists. And um, they have the science that calls them to be telepathic. In Montegre hyphen bay and I run Arrington hyphen bay, we don't have it. So we don't um, have the um, ability to cause harm in that manner. And we, and we wouldn't want to do it anyway. That's not part of our ancestral background to behave like a savage. Um, we civilize many nations as Moors, as Moorish Americans. And we are supposed to be returning back to that state of mind and understand what civilization is. Um, and that's through um, divine thoughts, words, and deeds. So um, I'm just giving you that um, testimony. Um, I'm thankful and grateful that I'm able to give testimony about it. Because many times spirits try to say, I've heard spirits say she's talking. Now imagine how many Moors or souls experiencing these things, but they don't say anything. So they either, so um, I just got the reading about the 14th Amendment, okay, and how it was ratified. It was never ratified illegally, but they um, tried to force the Southern states through military abuse, okay, military control to ratify this 14th Amendment that was never ratified, okay? The 14th Amendment, never ratified, but but if, if um, these uh, spirits are not, um, or these people are not um, op are navigating with rights, but privileges, then they are 14th Amendment citizens, right? They are 14th Amendment citizens, okay? Because um, people still talk about the 14th Amendment. So um, imagine how many um, souls who feel like they can't speak about what they experienced because, and they end up accepting this science that causes the master to be telepathic, or they end up amalgamating with unclean, soulless filth, unclean spirits, all right? They know it's nasty, they know it's filthy, and they have to lay down and sleep with it, and they feel like they have nobody to call upon for help. Their mind is being possessed, their spirit is possessed. Imagine, okay? So I give honor and praise to um, Allah as a soulful American that I'm able to give a testimony according to Revelations chapter 12, um, chapter um, 12, verse 11 and 12, Islam. Um, it's March the 17th, 2019, Islam.